dot mail. Animal alphabet. I can't believe my mind! We're going to have a Manga Tsika adventure with three L's! Which three L's am I talking about? Lemurs, letters, and lots of animal friends! <laughs> Come with me on an amazing alphabet adventure! We'll start by signing in. To sign in, we'll type your name, click here, then click Start. If you've signed in before, just click your name from the list below, then click Start. That'll start the game from where you left off last time! Come on! Let's leap over to Animal Junction! <laughs> Click here to set your skill level. Medium. Alright, right, let's play! Alright, Zabu wants to learn about letters. You can help him by clicking on things in Animal Junction. I can't believe it. We've checked it out, and do you know what? There is one animal whose name starts with every letter of the alphabet visiting here today. This could only happen in Animal Junction. Before we start, we need to show you a few things about the game to help you play. To move to another part of Animal Junction, move your mouse to the side of the screen and click on the arrows. And while you're looking around Animal Junction, be sure and click on the things you see. Some of our animal friends are hiding, and you never know who you're going to find. When you discover a new creature, you'll get a new page in your Creature Adventure book. The page will tell you cool stuff about the animal you just found. It will also tell you the first letter of the animal's name. You can click here on the book at any time to see what animals you found. You can also click on the book to see what letters you still need to find. When you find all 26 animals, you'll get a special prize! You'll be able to print out a set of flashcards that will help you learn your animal alphabet. Oops, we almost forgot! Some of the animals you click on will have games for you to play. You can change the game to make it a little easier or a little harder by clicking here. Click on number one for an easier level. Click on number two for a medium level. And click on number three for a level that's a little harder. But remember, if you change the level while playing a game, that game will start over. Okay, okay let's, let's play! N. M. M is for monkey. This monkey is a white-fronted capuchin. And he's on the search for something. I wonder what he's looking for. This monkey is on a mission, but... I wonder what this monkey is searching for. What are you looking for? Hey, maybe he's itchy and he's just looking for a good scratch. Huh? Monkeys groom each other's fur and pick out all the dirt, dust, and bugs. Wow, what a great Animal Friends notebook. You've got a lot of animals here. You can click on the yellow letters at the bottom of the screen to see the animals in your creature notebook. If the letters are not yellow, that means you still need to find the animal in Animal Junction or complete a game to collect that page for your book. You can click here to see a video clip or hear a fun animal fact. Capuchin monkeys got their names because of the little cap of hair on top of their head. See it? It's a different color than the rest of the hair. This monkey is a white... That M! R. R is for rhinoceros. A rhinoceros horn isn't made of bone. It's made of keratin fibers, the same stuff that's in your hair and fingernails. A rhinoceros horn isn't made of L L L is for lemur. I'm a kind of a lemur called a sapaka. Well, that's me on my mom's back. We like to hang upside down and play too. And she gives me lemur back rides. That's a fun way to leap. All kinds of lemurs love lemur back rides. Soon after a baby lemur is born, he'll start riding around on his mother's back as she leaps through the trees. But pretty soon, he'll be leaping around on his own. Back. L. X. X. 
X is for Xenops. Xenops are small birds that are found in South America. They're only five inches long, and they like to build their nests in a hole in a decaying tree. Back! R. C. C is for chameleon. Mungatsika! It's my friend Shark, the chameleon! The word chameleon begins with C? Yep, definitely C. Look at all the great pages this shark has for us to color. The pages have pictures of some of my animal friends. Well, you can use the arrows to select your favorite animal friend, then choose the color from the leaves and click on the picture to color it. I like making my own colors. Well, you can do that by clicking here. For a special surprise, click here. Oh, oh yeah, I almost forgot. You can also print the pictures and color them later. The page will print when you click here. And don't forget, you might need a grown-up to make sure your printer is working. F is for fox. G is for gecko, P is for pig, R is for raccoon, C is for cow, Z is for zaboomafu. <laughs> hey, that's me! Zaboomafu. S is for squirrel, B is for butterfly, F is for fox, G. Back. Chameleons can change their color, but not only to match the place they're hiding in, like most people think. A chameleon's color can also change because of changes in light and temperature, or when he's scared or happy. X, C, N. N is for nuthatch. Narchi and I are racing across the Zabu land. Well, you can help me win by unscrambling the word. Just drag the letters and put them in the right order. When you think you've got it right, click on the spinner. If you spelled the word correctly, I'll move the number of spaces highlighted on the spinner. Well, if you spell the word wrong, Narchi will move that number of spaces. If I land on the Goobleberry space, I can leap to the other Goobleberry. The first one to the end wins. Crab. C R A B Good one! Now we can leap, leap, leap. One, sheep. S H E H E E E P Good one! Now we can leap, leap, leap. One, Two camel C A M E L E L Manga Zika, that's it. Let's leap. One goose O S E O E O S G Now we can leap, leap, leap. One, two, three, four. Moose. E, S, O, O, M, O. That's right. Move ahead. One, two, goat. A, G, O, A, T. That's right, move ahead. One, two, three, four. Seal. S A E A L E A. Good one. Now we can leap, leap, leap. One, two, frog. 
O F G. That's right. Move ahead. One lemur. L L E M M U R U R. That's right. Move ahead. One, two, three, four. Duck. D U C. Good one. Now we can leap, leap, leap. One, two, three, four. Horse. H O R S E E S. Good one. Now we can leap, leap, leap. One, two, bison. B I N O S N O N. That's right. Move ahead. One, eagle. E A G A G G A E. Mongatsika, that's it. Let's leap. One, two, woof. W O L F O L O L. That's right. Move ahead. One, two, bear. B E A R A E A R. That's right. Move ahead. One, we win. Let's race again. You did great. Here's your page for your book. Play again. The red-breasted nuthatch can hang upside down by his feet while he tries to get insects out of small cracks in trees. R X A A is for armadillo. Ar armadillos have heavy banded shells that are like armor, but they can float in the water by filling their intestines with air. X U A D D is for dog. I people call dogs man's best friend, and they should. Dogs have lived with people for more than twelve thousand years. Their closest wild relative is the wolf. That L U U is for wakari. Wakari are shaggy, furred monkeys that live in South America. They have bald faces and heads that get really red when they get excited. L U J J is for jaguar. Yeah, jaguars are water wrestling wildcats. <laughs> He might want to stay in the pool all day. Jaguars are one of the few big cats who love swimming. Most cats don't like the water, but jaguars love it. In fact, jaguars are great swimmers, and they'll go into the water to hunt turtles, fish, capybaras, and even crocodiles. M V V is for vulture. Turkey vulture is a large bird that has a great sense of smell. He can smell his food from a long way off and swoop down from high in the air to get it. That X S J S is for salamander. A salamander! Oh, what a great creature! It's a spotted salamander. Wow! Look at all those spots. Whatever salamander you look at, you have to be really gentle. 
especially when you put them back. And here's how you put back a salamander the right way. First, you grab the rock and you put it back. And then you put the salamander back beside the rock and you let him crawl under the rock himself. Salamanders are amphibians, which means they live part of their lives in the land and part of their lives in the water. L J P. P. P is for penguin. P is for penguin. Like my friends, Splish and Splash, the African penguins. Penguins love to swim and play in cold, icy water. Hey, let's play a game in the icy cold water with my penguin friends. I'll ask you a question about one of my friends. You'll find the answer hidden behind the ice blocks. Oh, bounce the ice cube off the iceberg at the bottom of the screen. When the ice cube bounces up, it'll smash the blocks at the top of the screen. You, you can slide the iceberg back and forth with your mouse to keep the ice cube from falling in the water. When you smash all the blocks, you'll see the answer. Be careful. You can only miss the ice cube three times before you have to start over. What big cat is orange with black stripes? Great job! I knew you could do it! Great bouncing! Great bouncing! Cool! You sure can bounce that ice! Great bouncing! <laughs> oh, you missed that one. Oh, you'll get it this time. Tiger. You did great. Here's your page for your book. Play again. Unlike most penguins, black-footed penguins live in a warmer climate. They spend most of the day in the water and cool nights on land. If the penguins aren't able to reach the water, like when they watch over their eggs, they cool off by flapping their flippers, feet, and keeping their beaks open.